Hi, welcome back to my channel. I'm very pleased to see you um, during this lockdown in January 2021. We're just in um, the playroom that I was set up for homeschooling, just taking a small um, look to see um, how I feel. And to be honest, I feel really relaxed. I feel it's cool, airy. I've got my colourful organiser just behind me. I've got a few trucks that my son, Zach, enjoys, who's four years old. And I really feel relaxed. The best thing about this room that it's just really cool. I can feel the cool breeze. And I think that's quite refreshing, especially if you're doing um, studying. You need to stay a little bit alert, um, especially if you're doing meditation as well. That it's the ideal temperature. In fact, as an improvement, I think I'm going to put a thermometer, a wall thermometer in the room so I can gauge what temperature it is and keep it to this nice temperature all of the time okay so why are we in this room well just before homeschooling i just wanted to have a a quick i don't know a, a sneak peek sit down in the room and i kind of felt like i needed to read a book so for me reading is a must i think that reading is the perfect experience between parent and child and I believe in reading time and time again with my child. I feel that um, reading is charming. It's one of the most delightful things that we can have, especially when we have really nice books with strong and colourful illustrations, um, where it just captures um, special moments in everyday life. Some of the books that I have are just really nice storybooks that have rhythm and rhyme others have excellent pictures some have um descriptions and day-to-day -day life and moral stories um and some of them about faith so i think when i want to grow my child's faith in a natural way i want to fill their hearts with delight and confidence in god and i want to know that god cares for them so i pick topics to show that god cares for them I want them to have an appreciation of God who is all-knowing and the creator. I think this um, really captures feelings and emotions um, for the child when it comes in what we want their faith life to be like. So without too much delay, let's get, get going and let's read a book. One of the books that I have for my son in the playroom amongst others because we've got quite a few is called that Allah knows all about you it's hardback it's age appropriate for a four-year-old and it's got some nice illustrations let's have a quick sneak peek in one or two of the pictures wow this is absolutely amazing can you see some pictures here now what it says here it says from my fingers, and there's a picture of the boy with the fingers, and to my toes. This could get really interactive. I could ask my son to show me his fingers, show me his toes, whilst I'm reading this, and here we could have a good interactive session. Finally, the last page, which we're just going to take a sneak peek on. It says, with his love and his care, Allah will always be there. Allah knows all about me. Wow, that's absolutely amazing. You see that? Absolutely amazing. A beautiful, colourful rainbow. It's matching my organisational box just behind there. And two little cute characters. Bless. I thought that was absolutely wonderful. And I feel that the hardback books are excellent because they are more durable. They will last a long time. Um, it just feels nicer as well just to have something more harder to hold on to rather than the flimsy paper books. Um, so that's my reading for today. I hope you enjoyed that. If you want to know anything more about the reading, do let me know. We'll have longer story sessions in other videos. Thank you so much. Take care. Goodbye.